Hi guys, welcome to the unboxing quick review of this Ulancy tripod uh, ball head U120L. The listing on Amazon says mini metal inverted ball head camera tripod mount or cost with 360 degrees rotating with quick release plate, cold shoe, L shape positioning, baffle. So here's the thing or the package we can see also some description here. Maybe we get some website information support here. It's so small printed. I cannot even read that. So let's take it out of the box and see what we get. So here we are. We get even this tool or tools here and here's this tripod ball head. It's a little bit difficult to shake it out. Yeah, I really have to take it out like this. This is a little bit insane. I mean, it's okay to have good protection, but this is almost a little bit of overkill. So here we have the quarter inch mount. You can see it fits perfectly to a normal tripod like this one here. Of course, it's a small one, but I just wanted to show you that here as an example. I point the camera here so you can see it much better how we have it here on top and we have mainly three screws which we can work with we have the one here in red we have the one here in black and we have this one here yeah red and black so we'll start with the one uh, here this is the one which we secure from moving around like 360 degrees this screw yeah no matter how much we are loosening this thing uh, it, it moves about in the same speed for me it looks like that is some nice damping yeah, I have to secure this even a little bit more so it, it has some kind of a damping it doesn't move freely around you can see how nicely this is moving there must be some built-in uh, damping so it's not shaking it's not going faster and slower it almost goes this all the time in the same speed this is absolutely nicely built here i can also show you this 360 degree thing how nicely this is floating watch this thing i don't even touch this thing and it's moving very slow steadily and what we have of course is this second screw here where we can remove then the mounting plate for the camera and we remove it a bit so you can see also it has these limiter screws on the side one here and one here and we have this opening so uh, even when it gets loose uh, it shouldn't uh, fall uh, off directly and here we have the normal mount here which you can use like with a screwdriver or with, with any kind of coin to attach it uh, to the camera this is uh, still something which i really don't like too much but it works you can see we even can uh, move it around from left to right wherever we want to position that and it's not falling off it's nicely secured i mean it's not bad definitely it's a rather good thing a definitely solid construction we can place it here uh, somewhere where we want and then secure it here but these screws are really independent uh, from that and uh, i mean we can secure the 360 all as well that everything is nicely secured so everything uh, can be adjusted uh, individually and then we have this uh, ball mount here and so we can freely move it around i mean almost freely here we have around 90 degrees angle and here on this side as well i would say it's about exactly 90 degrees angle on this side and yeah, maybe 45 degrees same thing here but we don't need that i mean we can always use one of the 90 degrees and then uh, move it around this screw of course is not like a lock or unlock this can be a little bit adjusted so you have so you can also mount it that you can move it around still and still have it somehow secured let's say for a lighter camera for gopro or so that you can still move it around if you tighten it uh, too much you cannot move it around like for heavier cameras you probably will uh, use it like this but for me definitely works really good especially for such cheaper tripods so it saves me a lot of money i don't have to buy the whole thing with this thing 
I have uh, the full function, full full flexibility on every tripod I need. I would say everything is really good. I mean, we have. Uh, if you want to remove this uh, limiter screws here, I think that's the smallest hex tool for here. And here on the side, we have this cold shoe mount. You can see we can have it like this, uh, rotatable, but of course you can also secure it more with this hex tool and then we cannot move it around. So depending on your needs, you can have it either fully secured or a little bit loose. Yeah, I think this is as good as it gets. I've never seen such a thing in such a good quality and I would say I can give you full recommendation on that and I'll put down the link to the Amazon listing down into the description so you can check it out and load it right from there if you like it and I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video. If you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below. I'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, thanks for watching and see you next time. Thank you.